So, uh, so let's look at uh, let's look at some of the portfolio videos, right? Like, uh, starting with uh, maybe Monish Babri's uh, free lunch portfolio. We've done a video on that. It's probably uh, the most viewed video on our channel with uh, over five thousand views. Uh, so <laughs> definitely check that out. Um, but we'll go over like how that's performing. Uh, we are almost little over the midway mark. So this is the shameless cloning portfolio, which we'll link which we have linked in all of our videos down in the description but we'll also link it into this video but here we are tracking our free lunch portfolio against the magic formula portfolio again on which we have done an episode against our cbm portfolio which is a portfolio that atit and i manage uh internally just to learn about investing and see how will we if we are able to beat the index and as you can see currently we are beating the index <gasps> The index is at 4.25%, our portfolio is at 1.29%, but uh, as you can see, the principal amount is 8,000, but we've only invested 5,000 of it. We are still holding $3,000 in cash. But as Atit mentioned, let's look at free lunch portfolio. Essentially, what we did in January is uh, based on the blog article that Munish Paparai writes, we created this portfolio and invested 10,000 in each company. Uh, and let's see which companies are performing the best right now. There are 15 companies um, divided into spawners, cloning, Uber cannibals, three categories that he has, right? Uh, and to get details about each of these categories, check out the, the older video. There were 15 stocks and only three of them are in positive. Yeah, it's the restaurant brands, Chipotle Mexican Grill and Assured Guarantee, which was an insurance company. It's amazing. Like Chipotle is a pretty, pretty... Heavily. We did an episode on Chipotle at the time. I think we didn't invest in it, but uh, looks like they've been outperforming pretty well. Like, head. yeah, when we, I think when we did Chipotle, our fair value was coming around 400, 500. And we decided because at that really? time, yeah, yeah, yeah. At that time, <laughs> okay. it was really overvalued. And we thought against investing. The fair price for Chipotle is estimated at 478 with a range of it being between 382 to 575. Atit, what is Chipotle currently trading at? 1,350. 1,350. Almost so three based, times. Three times. So based on that, I think it's not selling at a discount. The sheer suddenness of the move, the unexpected nature of the move, the unpredictability of the move. Once more, once more. I was reading that the restaurant industry in general, their PE is around 26 or something. Okay. Uh, for this, the analysts for Chipotle, they are expecting the PE to be around 44. And if we change it to 44, let's see what happens. 2000. Okay. So we're getting a discount, I guess. Yeah. So that's why there are so many people jumping onto Chipotle right now. I am noob. Uh, and as we said, like it's cloning. So Munish Pabrai cloned this from Bill Ackman, who is also performing really well with his portfolio. Bill Ackman, right? Uh, he... I think his thesis coming into 2022 was inflation and buying uh, consumer discretionary brands, uh, which mostly with the reopening uh, also becoming a dominant theme. I think he uh, he focused more on buying like Chipotle, Domino's Pizza, restaurant brands, Hilton, uh, worldwide holdings, right? You can see that in like Q3 of 2021, like he added to a bunch of these uh, companies as he current still holds he looks like he's starting to uh, reduce some of that but those were the ones that are doing well let's look at these three companies which are not doing so well uh tencent holding micron technology and alibaba yeah all three of them looks like uh like they've been punished because of exposure to china and supply chain uh especially for like micron supply chain is been an issue that was it for today's episode sorry about the abrupt end this is tapan from the editor's desk we had a further discussion on alibaba and how are we finding the stock in the current market condition but that episode and the discussion will be released tomorrow if you enjoyed this episode please hit the like button down below thank you okay bye okay thank you